Now to your top 10 headlines in just two minutes. A plane hit. Oh my God. At least two people, including a UPS truck driver, are dead after a plane crashed into a San Diego area neighborhood. Cars and homes turned into fireballs. We'll have more on this scene coming up at 11.15. Sacramento investigators need your help identifying this man. He's believed to be at least 85 years old, lives in the Oak Park area, and appears to suffer from a memory loss-related illness. A Caltrans tractor driver is suffering major injuries after being hit by a big rig off I-80. It happened between Dixon and Vacaville. CHP says the big rig caught fire after the crash. California will ban sales of new gas lawnmowers and leaf blowers opting for all electric models as soon as 2024. Tonight, many have questions about how it will work. So only so much work will be able to get done in the day before we have to go back home and call it a day early to go charge our equipment. The Association of Southwest Airlines Pilots is now speaking out after Southwest Airlines canceled more than 2,200 flights over the past several days. Until the company makes some changes in how they're doing business in internally and scheduling our pilots, we're going to continue to see the problem. 19 months later, for the first time since the pandemic, a cruise ship has docked in San Francisco. Those on board are fully vaccinated and had to test negative two days before departing on the Majestic Princess. I'm happy that we were able to be a part of something historic, so to speak. Following a 30-month hiatus, the Boston Marathon returned today. For the very first time, the iconic race happened in the fall. The drug company Merck just asked federal regulators to authorize the first antiviral pill to treat COVID-19. Plan on trick or treating? Dr. Anthony Fauci says outdoor activities should be fine, but is urging masking for unvaccinated kids. And today on National Coming Out Day, DC Comics announced the newest Superman is bisexual. Superman's son, John Kent, will begin a romantic relationship with a male friend in the latest issue of the coming. And those are your top 10 headlines in just two minutes.